we have been fishing for 40,000 years, constantly improving our fisheries and our nets. Fishing became an industry. It's no longer a question of family, but of investment and technology. To increase our catch, our fishermen formed fleets. What changed everything is the invention of the deep sea trawl, a large net with a funnel-shaped opening like the mouth of the whale shark. Our nets are so large that some measure 40 kilometers. Then entire factories took to the sea. We use probes, radar, and focus all our ingenuity on hunting down marine life. Every year, we fish 90 million tons of wild fish globally. Half this amount is fished by only 1% of our fishing boats. My trawlers, my seines, my nets are so vast that I no longer select my catch. I take all that comes and sort it later depending on the market value of the fish. Peruvian anchovy, Alaska pollock, Atlantic herring. We just scoop it all up. There's no limit to our predation, apart from the fish quotas fixed by scientists. But who can prevent us from exceeding them? Worldwide, 80% of commercial fish stocks have been declared fully exploited or overexploited. Our fishing has reached a ceiling. We are at a biological limit. How could we have got to this point? Our intensive fishing sacrifices millions of fish. These are the waste, the rejects of the catch, or just the fish crushed to death in our nets. Fish killed for nothing. <laughs> 